Welcome back, everybody, to Seven Days to Die and Alpha 21. I'm an old guy gaming, and in this episode, we're going to do another random loot sesh. Uh, so we have uncovered uh, the perimeter of our town here. And uh, so we're going to start working more on the interior. Uh, so we'll, we'll do like this little north section here. And um, for our first, you know, for the first few random loot sessions we're not really going indoors so much uh, we're just hitting you know cars mailboxes uh things on the outside if, if if there's like a garage or something open that we can easily get to uh, we will pop in there too um all right so let's get started here and of course we'll kill any zeeks that we come across um we are almost ready for the next level which is going to be a uh, minor 69er definitely want to do that because I do not want to um, I don't want to go mining again without at least 1.69er it's painful <laughs> uh, okay doesn't look like we've done anything with this stand here so let's check this nice oh the other thing too is uh, we I, I want to grab some coal I'll probably do that off camera though because um seed crafting uh, because i can make um mineral water and actually i have been able to for quite some time but i just forgot about it and i kept making red tea but uh there's no point in making red tea when we can make mineral water it just requires a golden rod and a coal in addition to the chrysanthemum in the water so it's definitely worth doing another pistol peaked you are more accurate when rapid firing nine millimeter weapons okay Machine Gunner. Fully automatic mode does 1% more damage per hit until you miss. Yes. Thank you. We will take that. Okay. Um, let's just po poke our head through the window. Like I said, we're not going to do actually do the POI, but we'll grab a couple things if they're easy to grab. Pay to park. Let's just pop our head in here. There's a broken safe and a chair. Doesn't look like there's anything that's really worthwhile uh, grabbing in there. So did we check this? Yes, we did. Okay, let's move on down the street. Maybe what we'll actually do is we'll just go, we'll just go right down this main street and then we'll, uh, then we'll probably circle around and come back through here because it looks like there's a couple factories or something on the back side of these buildings. Dude bros. Knuckles. And a pistol Pete book that we've already read. Okay. Check this shopping cart. A little more water. We we just checked that, right? Yeah. Okay. All right, we got some mailboxes here. Some somewhere. This is bar brawler. When in combat, health recovers one hit point with every punch. Okay. At some point, I know I keep saying this, but at some point we really need to give Brawling a, a good run. I did it once a long time ago on a multiplayer sesh with um, with um, Darkness Falls, but that was like, like four years ago, so it's been a while. Arlene, what are you doing up there? Ooh, feral Arlene. Okay, she did. Let's go hit this dumpster. Yeah, a lot, uh, a lot of the stuff that I'm looting, I'm probably just gonna throw out because we don't need to loot lead anymore. We're mining that stuff. All right, this is a quest that we have to do or a mission, but we're not gonna do missions in this episode. We'll come back to it later. 
Okay, we'll grab that. Got a book here. Handguns, nice. Some golden rod. I like these little news stands here. Wise guy, CPA. Darlene. There we go. Okay. Let's, we're going to throw that right on into 69 or so the next time I mine, it'll be painful and not super painful. <laughs> Help us break things more quickly and so forth too. So it's a good one to do. Mostly the stamina, of course. Just use so much stamina when you don't have, uh, when you don't have points in that. Just poke her head in here real quick. Yeah. All right. Nope. More than we want to get involved in today. Let's continue on down the street. We'll pick up some of this trash too and clean the town up a bit. So we'll pick a rock up. Spear Hunter. Power attacks now penetrate and damage multiple enemies. That's a good one. I think we're one magazine uh, or book away from yep we just needed the the degrade 20 percent slower and then kill kills with spears refill your stamina that's going to be so nice when we get that all right check this trash here Let's get rid of a couple things. Got lots of yucca seed. Don't need that. Um, don't need the clay or this or this. Let's repair our stone axe and then chuck those. I'm hanging on to this because now we can make the stew, plus we need them for the garden, so I'm actually prioritizing those. We don't really need iron. Do we have, do we have anything that needs to be... Repaired. Now nah, we're in pretty good shape, so just gonna chuck that. Or you know what we could do instead, actually. Let's just scrap anything that we can easily make in the forge, like nails and pipes, for example. Um, before we scrap the pipe, though, do we have a pipe weapon that needs to be? Not really. Not really. Okay. Yeah. Let's scrap them. We can toss feathers. Um, I mean, I can make gunpowder now, so I don't think I'll, I'll keep that. 23 paper is probably enough for us to keep, and uh, we don't need chrysanthemum seed. These seeds are a little rarer, so we'll probably hang on to those. Okay, great. Um, speaking of which, I want to, I want to start picking up some chrysanthemum and more specifically goldenrod. I've got... Chrysanthemum, but if we come across goldenrod, we're going to grab it. And if we happen to see an, a coal node anywhere nearby, we'll, we'll take a few hits off of that, too. I have a coal mine. In fact, I have a mine for all of the, the ores, but it's all out west of town. Compared to there. Claw hammer quality three. Nice. Let's check this. A little bit of wood. Another pistol, Pete. 20% more range when using a scope or iron sights. Beautiful. Iced. You can fall up to 15 meters without taking damage if you're carrying 5,000 dukes or more. Okay. 
and a bow. Now we can make primitive bow quality two. Okay, let's go back this way. Oh shit, he's feral. Seven hundred fifty XP for us, baby. Spears, we like spears. We already checked those. Okay, let's keep on keeping on. I love these random loot sessions, man. They're just chill. Well, not always. <laughs> Sometimes they can be pretty rough on us. Um, we'll scrap this and we'll poke this. Uh, we don't need, yeah, we don't need to do lead anymore. Uh, we'll take both of those. Here's a little bit of goldenrod and chrysanthemum. For that mineral water. Uh, that, yeah, we'll take all of that, actually. Okay. That brings us to the end of the downtown area. Uh, let's just keep going down the street and we'll hit any mailboxes and cars that we see and then we'll turn around and start moving in the other direction. Um, I have one of these already, so let's sell the schematic. We do want all the rest of that stuff. There's a chicken. Chicken in the tennis courts. He's a tennis chicken. Is there anything lootable down here? Oh, shit. Don't quite have shotgun skill up to par yet. Of course, we're using a pipe shotgun too, so that's part of it. Check this duffel bag. Okay, we'll take that. Might keep it, might sell it. I don't know. We'll see. not going to buy any beverage because we can make beverage. Just take a quick peek in here. Let's check this and this. And this. And this. Okay, that's it. I'm not doing anything else in here. Let's check this vehicle. White SUV. Um, no, no, no. Scrap. No, and take the rest of that. Say hi to Marlene. Let's uh, see if there's any mailboxes in this cul-de-sac. Mailboxes and vehicles. Come on, Ronnie McDonnie. No. Scrap. Poke. I actually probably chuck that. Wiring. We should be able to make electric fences by now, I would think. We seem to get a lot of wiring magazines. We can't. Um, I 
What do we need to make an electric fence? Oh, traps. Wow, okay. It's, yeah, uh, we're, it's going to be a little while before we can do that then. Grab some chrysanthemum and goldenrod. Oh, I like the sound of the knife now. <laughs> I didn't even notice that until just now. Very cool. Love it. Chuck, 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 chuck. Put this, 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 that. Those and the copy in the mini bike. Okay. That's a creepy looking house. I love it. Let's hit this automobile over here. I don't think I'm going to take either one of these items. When the time comes for us to get gas, we're going to go out to the desert and mine a bunch of oil shale. I need to collect corn and potatoes when we come across them, too, so we can make meat stew and all that. Oh, and, well, hobo stew, actually. Okay. We'll follow this um, road all the way to the end. Well, actually, let's get some corn while we're here. Hopefully no pig spawn. I'm going to use the knife just because I like the sound of it. Reloaded. Yes, we are. Oh, shit. That's great. <laughs> These guys don't make noise all the time anymore. Sneak right up on you. He could have bit our little toe right off. Little bastard. Gonna be mineral water for us. This combine's cool looking. Is there anything? Oh. Uh here. Let's climb back up here for a second. Nope. Okay. Um, are there any potatoes over here? If we can find another uh, uh, Fermier residence, or however you say that, they they actually have a garden with stuff in it. Uh, potatoes, blueberries, that sort of thing. I know there's one uh, kind of out on the eastern edge of town. See if there's anything over here. Might be some enemies around, actually. Case in point. All right, what do we got over here? Fertilizer. That's just nitrate. 
we mining that so we don't need to harvest it. Okay. Little mud puddle there. All right, do we get all the corn out of this field? I think so. I don't see any more green corn plants. Well, they're, let's go back this way because they, uh, they don't spawn until we get close because of, probably because of my settings. I thought about bumping them up a little bit, but I gotta say, I've already told you guys this, but this is the smoothest running alpha I have ever played from seven days to die from the fun pimps. And it's running so well, I kind of don't want, oh shit. I kind of don't want to mess with it, you know? I mean, I, I could screenshot my settings and that would put it back if, you know, if I did tweak it, but I don't know. I'll have to think about it. I've had very, very little, if any, performance issues. Frame rate drops, stuff like that. But there have been some other weird stuff. Weird things that have happened. All right, we have to just be careful with this wandering horde. Uh, we'll take that and that. Let's keep the bike a little closer to us. There's usually a zombo that spawns, a sleeper that spawns in this, next to this guy. Maybe not this time. Either that or it's going to pop in right in front of our face. Oh, I guess I've already looted that. Okay. Well, why don't we... Why don't we um, just zip on down this street? We're going to get chased, but um, I just want to see... What's there. Yeah, I think we'll screw that. Don't need one cornmeal. Copper Ruski. Here's a mailbox. And some more corn, too. Hopefully we got... Oh, I guess I've looted that, too. Looks like we got far enough ahead of those guys so we don't have to worry about it. Yeah, we've we've been over here for looting. But I didn't get the corn. And yes, I am aware that feral pigs can spawn in these fields, so if that happens well, we're gonna get some bacon and eggs. Well bacon. No, I don't think I'm going to take that. Man, I love that sound. <laughs> I really do. What is this business? I don't think I want to know. No. Ku Klux Klan burning cross business? Could be. All right, I think we got all the corn in this little field. Here comes a dog. Oh, shit. The 
bleed can wait. <laughs> wow. Okay. They're still coming. Let's move. There's another field there. Let's park over on this side. Um, all right, we have an infection, so let's um let's not take any honey. Oh, never mind, we have honey. It's gonna say let's not take it because we left it at home, but we didn't leave it at home. Uh, I don't want the feathers. I think we can make these in the forge, can't we? If we can, there's no point in... Yeah, it doesn't show up there. I don't know. I'll have to check. I'm going to hang on to it for now, but I think we can. I'm going to take another bandage, too, because we got thumped pretty good there and then bled out for a bit. Hi, yo. Corn's pretty easy to gather in this game. It's the potatoes that are harder to come by. Oh, shit. Big mama. Okay, so we've checked that mailbox, too. You know what? I think when we last did our random loot sesh, we, we kind of covered this area over here, or at least part of it. So we've, we've come all the way up this street here. So why don't we, uh, why don't we go along here and then, yeah, just kind of follow this, the street along that way. We may have also done this one too. Yeah, I think we have. Yeah, this was Joel's house. There's one thing, a corn. And a yo. Here, let's give you a bleed. Let's see if he, if, if he bleeds out before we have to hit him again. Oh, potatoes, nice. Oh, shit. Where the freaking lumberjack here? We'll take some mushroom spores. Look at what's sitting right there. Oh. Yeah, it won't take me too long to break through this. It's worth a, a weapons bag. More handgun parts. Okay. That was worthwhile. Let's grab this one potato plant. Are there any more? I don't see any more. There's some kind of a garden over here. Let's go check it out. Interesting. Let's 
because that wasn't really much of a garden. This does look like a stables of some sort. We don't really need meat, though, at this point in time. We're, we're doing really well on that. This looks like a pig trough. Where's the pigs? Hmm. I don't know. Nice loot. Also not so bad. Okay, let's go ahead and grab this and this. Scrap and chuck. Let's get rid of that guy. Oh, we got a Steve over here. more golden rod. Here's a new mailbox. Deal 10% more damage with fists, leather, iron, and spike to knuckle weapons. Yep, we'll take that. <clears throat> Alright, I need to drop a few things off in the bike here. Oh, guess we have stuff in the bike. Anything else will go in there? Couple things. All right, I want to go through this field here really quick, too. How much corn do we have? We have 36. That's that's pretty good, actually. This will be the last corn gathering we'll do on this loot session. But we might as well grab it because it's right here. You can also use it for cornmeal, too, so it's got multiple purposes. This would appear to be a greenhouse. Sweet, sweet honeypot farms. But it looks like it's a flower... Flower greenhouse. Which is fine, because we need... Uh, flowers, too. get honey from these things? I'm thinking probably not. Yeah, I've done that POI a few times. There's a duffel bag. Oh, and a snake. Tried to bite us, but he didn't get us.
Big Mama just keeled over. Her TTL ran out. Uh, that's worth taking in fixing up the cell. Big Mama. Oh, you did drop a bag, and it's a blue one at that. Look at that. I didn't hear the, the little cha-ching thing it normally makes. We need all of this stuff. Um, We might just have to make a, a drop chest. Okay. Let's grab the ammo for sure. No crawling allowed, Igor. Where's our bike? It's over there. Yeah, you know what? I want to keep going anyways. So, oh, here I, <laughs> I'm calling it a drop chest again. Uh, let's just make a chest. Thank you.